In this tutorial, we will go over a new feature that was added in Pro Series 2018. The new feature is called Refresh Updates. You might be wondering why, and more importantly, what does it do? Briefly, the Refresh Updates option was added to improve a common update issue we refer to as the update loop. The typical symptom I'm describing is either when Pro Series is opened, it prompts to install updates, and after installing them, they fail to apply. Or, Pro Series checked for updates, and the updater displayed a message saying there are no updates found, even though there were updates to download. As you can see, the new feature streamlines the process of correcting failed updates, as well as provides the opportunity to self-help and can save you valuable time and effort correcting issues associated to failed updates. The symptoms I mentioned happens in circular fashion, which is why we refer to them as an update loop. As mentioned earlier, the new feature will save you valuable time and effort because with the simple click of a button, the Pro Series updater will do the rest. Now that we understand why this feature was implemented, let's briefly go over the feature and what it does. Before we continue, you need to ensure the Pro Series application is updated to the latest version of 2018.16.00.10. To find out if you have the correct version, go to the Help menu and click on About Pro Series. On the About Pro Series screen, click on the version tab. We recommend making a note of the program version to compare. If the version is not correct, then update Pro Series. You can pause this video and return to it after you have updated. After the latest updates are applied, Pro Series will include a new menu option that can be found in two locations, under the Update menu in Pro Series and under the Start menu. Once the menu button is clicked, the Pro Series updater will do the rest. Now that you know where to find the menu options, what happens next when Refresh Updates is started? To avoid complicating what happens under the hood, we simply say the files in the Updates directory are deleted. This is so the updater can begin from scratch. Next, Pro Series will download all the relevant Prime patches based on the form products you have installed. After downloading the patches, the updater will install them as normal and auto-heal itself in the process. We recommend using the Refresh Updates feature in the following situations. You experience the update loop as described earlier. You're certain there are new updates available, but the updater consistently gives you a message saying no updates found. You verified the version of a tax product is not up to date. Finally, we also recommend using Refresh Updates before attempting to uninstall and reinstall Pro Series. This troubleshooting step will save you time and effort from needing to do a full reinstall. A quick note about the Refresh Update feature. GIST-related errors may be corrected using the Refresh Update feature, but there is a known limitation with it when both Form 1040 and Form 1040NR are installed. A GIST error is when the version of the Pro Series calculation engine is not in sync with the version of the Pro Series application or form. For example, the version of the GIST file is newer and the version of the Pro Series application is older or vice versa. The recommendation is to run the regular Pro Series update after running refresh updates. The Pro Series update option can be accessed from the start menu as well. I hope this presentation was helpful. Thank you for listening.